No, it's good. We need two t-shirted men, and then we need your, you know, classic sailor, and then we've got your captain, the skipper. You're like the ship's bookkeeper. Cogifer. What about my appearance suggests bookkeeper? I don't know. You're like the gentleman sailor. We bring you out when there's like an inspection. Expect a sample of our sailors. Don't expect all of them. <laughs> These two are locked in the bilge. You're the, the, bilge. You're the ship actuary. <laughs> Avast ye scurvy dogs! The ship has sprung a leak! We're taking in water faster than a Kentucky whore! Get to the lifeboats! A Kentucky whore? Kentucky. They're more they take a lot of diuretics. <laughs> <laughs> They're more watery. This episode was sponsored by Kevin Hogan. He's a, a nautical enthusiast. And so that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be taking a trip into the sea in leaky boats. Who's going to sink? You know what Dylan means, don't you? From the sea. Does it really? What does Brogan mean then? Douchebag? Shoemaker. Shoemaker of the sea. They work for the mafia. They make concrete shoes for the the peep for the rats. Oh, you the would rats. say that. You would say that. You're German. <laughs> you're German. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, you're not. <laughs> I would like to thank Stephen M. Williams II for, the play for sending us this game. Lich's Lair Games in Chicago, Illinois. Go there for all your gaming needs. Lich's Lair Games, Chicago, Illinois, 85652. <laughs> What, what are the doubloons for? The huh? doubloons are just for color. They're not part of the game. What's a daboom? Bloom. The bloom. Oh, I needed to bring some doubloons to the area. <laughs> so You're so it. fucking retarded. <laughs> What's a doubloon? It's a nothing. It's that's not, nothing. That's, that's a doubloon <laughs> is a gold coin. Haven't you seen Goonies? Uh, this is a, a, a very wonderful beer that Samuel Adams makes called Noble Pills. This is the kind of beer I like because it, it doesn't have that horrible uh, IPA-ness to it that makes it taste like urine. This beer is hoppy. Well, maybe I just don't like the IPAs because they're too hoppy. All right, shipmates. The object of this game is to get your men from the sinking ship to the islands in the lifeboats without drowning in the briny deep. Starting with me, we place our boats this is the black boat. This doesn't really belong to anyone, but we can all use it. Oh. Who deployed that boat? Socialists. <laughs> yeah. We take turns placing our men in the boats. I'm on a motherfucking boat. Sade. Take a good hard look at the motherfucking boat. Sade. Now, what's the strategy here? That's two purples in one boat. <laughs> <laughs> These two guys love each other, okay? Sort of. They're asking and telling. I'm no Mormon, I just don't ship them out anywhere. I'm no Mormon. What happens is one of these boats springs a leak. Motherfucks. Oh. Purple! We all have to vote which boat springs a leak, and you do that by casting. Boat! by casting a secret so ballot. You did not tell me there would be a ever. democracy element to this game, yeah, okay? Never. You got a problem with that, you socialist? No, I don't have a problem with it knowing it ahead of time. If you play a captain card as your vote, and no one else plays a captain card, then you get to pick which boat <gasps> springs a leak. If two people play a captain's hat card, they cancel each other out. You only have three of these for the whole game. One, two, three. Oh, oh, Captain! Oh, who could pull that? Oh, shit! I choose the yellow one because yes! it has the least amount of people in it. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, the boat sinks if there's more leaks than people, right? Yes. Okay. So if this boat springs three leaks, then both of these dudes are dead. Now, um, one of the boats moves. So one, two, three, go! Oh, the Whoa, black, black, boat. black black. Now, we're in phase three. You get to move one of your people to a different boat. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's fabulous, isn't it's it? Fantastic. That's All right, this guy's boat. moving. Fuck it. Post. No, I'm, I'm out of this fucking ship. Everybody else is leaving. <laughs> Get out the boat! Get out the boat, bitch! Get out the boat! Get out the boat! Get out the boat, bitch! Get out the boat! Why are you moving my guy? I'm just kind of testing the waters. Stop molesting my guy. Quit molesting! <laughs> Quit okay. molesting. The Dylan Brogan story. <laughs> 
Kevin Hogan wanted us to make a toast to all the fellas overseas who, according to him, dwell in a place where the beer is scarce or just shitty. Uh, apparently, they're not stationed in Germany. So here's to all the guys overseas. Yeah, overseas. Yeah, thank, thank you, you gentlemen. Overseas in the fight. What do you guys think of lifeboats so far? I'm, do you feel the danger? I'm having a good time, as you like to say. Don't I mean, steal my catchphrase. And phrase. you like to say, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just kill me at finale? Okay. Which boat's gonna move? Yeah. Yeah. It's all black. If you know what I mean. All those seamen. <laughs> Uh, are on the land now. Keep in mind, fellas, right now, Aaron is winning. Which <laughs> boat is gonna spring a leak? Fuckers, do it up. Do it up, fuckers. Do it up, fuckers. Do it up, fuckers. Booyah! Orange Kabam! <laughs> <laughs> That's right, bitch! I don't think you can... I don't think you can orange boat. <laughs> I think it's out of... We, we, <laughs> we all just hate the fucking orange boat. <laughs> Preventive strike on the orange boat. The orange boat is sinking fast. Now Matt's winning, just so everyone is aware. That wow. island is getting crowded with venereal sailors. People who sail into disease. Sailing the high seas of gonorrhea. Venereal sailors. When a drip becomes a mighty tide. You know that the venereal sailors are coming soon. Yar, Yar. we've got crates of penicillin to load on board. <laughs> Have you got a fire down below? We are toasting Adina and Mike, uh, a lovely couple who we don't know, but uh, here's to not killing each other. Woo! Yay! Go forth into marriage and never look back. Just look back once. Once. Glance casually. Just once. Once. Right. He likes to move it, move it. He, he likes, likes to move, move it, move it. it. He, he likes, likes to move, move it, move it. it. He, he likes, likes to move boat. Boat? Boat? <laughs> that didn't make any sense. Let's lambast you for it. Yes, lambast me, Dylan. <laughs> Go ahead. Correct usage of that word. Has lambasting started yet? How did you switch us around so fast? Dylan, I think we need to get into more fiery arguments, or else yeah. the fans are going to be disappointed. They really are, because you guys just kind of look at each other now, just like... <laughs> <laughs> well played, old friend. <laughs> leak. I got a leak in my brand new mug. Go ahead, it's your mug. Doing, oing, oing, oing. What? Renaissance fair humor. Get it? I got a leak in my brand new mug. No, the other part. Go this ahead, your it's your mug. You set me up for a joke I know nothing about. Why did about. I think that he would do the other half of the joke? Do it, and I'll do it. I'll do it. I got a leak in my brand new mug. Boy, right? I did it better than him. Now the game is done. Okay, I know how many points I got. You guys go first. Cause Twenty-four. Twenty-two. Twenty-six. Twenty-eight. No! no! Old Sloney's back on top. That's what you get, Skipper. So, Laboom. Seriously, Dylan, Dylan, just try to fucking focus for once in your life, can you? Uh, yes, but you don't want to see the results. I do want to see the results. What do you want me to focus I've on? Because I've never seen What that. do you want me to focus just, on? I'm doing a great job. Laboom. Labouche. <laughs> Are we done with lifeboats now? Just, let's, let's fuck! <laughs> if two people just had sex on the table and we got it all on camera, it would be a really awesome. Yes. Uh, just somebody took Dylan and just bent him over the table. We've had and, this talk about molesting. And just, it's not molesting, it's full on rape. <laughs> <laughs> and just gives you the business right in the old yeah. back end. Is, is this where we've gotten to this point where we're just openly talking about you raping me? Not me, you someone else. Man. Oh, and so, so I, will I, will most likely, I will most likely say you. Saw he probably has the biggest dick, so he would. Oh, get out of here, like you know. Whip him out. Most. Whip them out. Uh, you guys were like, Dylan, we are entering a gentleman's agreement and your honor is on the line. And, you, and then all of a sudden, you guys like expose my testes to everyone in the well, whole we world. Expose we them? Yes. Just, you got up and let's roll I that clip. No. Let's roll that clip. Don't do it. It's in my pants. Let's see it. 
Take it out. Whip it out. Oh, yeah, do it out. I don't want to. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. Whip it out. I don't want to see it. Oh my God! I saw his testicle. I'm gonna rape. Oh, it seemed that you stood up and did it on your own, Dylan. I entered into a gentleman's agreement and no I fulfilled my bet. End. And later tonight, I'm gonna enter into your gentleman's agreement. No, I don't want any of these rape jokes around here. It's, it's a rape a, inevitability. It's not a joke. Fox is already developing that pilot, okay? You're gonna sit over here for the no, next No, 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 no,